Hi, broadcasting from Highgate House, uh, north of Northampton, maybe north of North, I don't really know where, which direction we got in a cab, Naomi and I, and got over here. Yeah, I've done a few other videos, uh, if you want to get a sense of where it is, it's this mag magnificent estate that we're staying on for this evening. But <clears throat> last weekend, I did a self-actualization in Barcelona, and there were four students from the chiropractic college, which... Uh, the president of the college asked me if I wanted to go work there, uh, and we'll see. I don't know if I'm cut out to be a uh, work in a chiropractic college, uh, but we'll see. But we did a class last weekend, uh, and there were four students from the college. And uh, when we finished up on Sunday, we, we, the, uh, what I say to people is, "Is your class starts on Sunday?" Okay, we do all this stuff, and it's not a lot of stuff. We sit around and talk, and we interview you, and we film you, uh, and we don't do any processing. Uh, we do ask you a lot of questions and laugh with or at you, depending upon where you are in a seminar. But there's actually no processing, because uh, I don't do that, and I haven't seen it work that well. So, um, But at any rate, we do that all weekend. And then what I say is your class starts Sunday night, uh, depending upon what time we finish is when your class starts. Because what we attempt to do is we attempt to take the biological computer, that's you, and take and show you the operating system that you came here operating on and show you how to default to it all weekend. right? And we, we keep pointing out when you're there, we keep bringing you present time consciousness and when you default to this really fun, pristine operating system. And then Sunday night, you go out and you're running on that system. Right? So we come back, you come back on Monday, Tuesday, and then Tuesday evening, we meet with you again, and you can bring guests, because it's really hard to explain what this is, so I say bring your friends if you if they see a difference in you, and want to see what you're doing. But a couple of things happened in Barcelona. One, one of the gals who did the seminar, who's done a bunch of different things, came back, and, and she said, the only word I've been using all weekend, or all day, Monday and Tuesday in school, she said, is intense. Because I don't think life is worth living if it's not intense. But we were in the class, and there was a young man, a chiropractic student named Dario, um, or Clark Kent, or Superman, or Buddy Holly, or whatever his alter ego is at the particular time, because he's quite a magnificent individual. But he, we were sitting, in, and he was in this space, and I couldn't see where the space was. And I said, what's going on? And he said, I'm buffering. <laughs> Get it? Okay, you know, when you download a film and it's not downloading fa fast enough and it sits in one spot and this little thing goes thing and it says buffering. <laughs> and he was just sitting there buffering. He couldn't figure anything out, which you can't. But I thought it's a great term for what happens a lot of my classes. A lot of people sit in the class and they just do some buffering for a while and let it rip. Uh, WWMIC Peak Performance. Uh, Noticing Fixes More Than Fixing is my book. Um, have a fun day.